Hello everyone, Mecha here, back along with the one and only Marky Joe. Hello, I can't see anything. Oh, that's right. I need to screenshot with Marky Joe. <laughs> damn. It's almost like I shouldn't be doing this. After oh, doing shit for two hours. But that's okay. Uh, Alright, cool. Now you can see it, right? Yes, I yes. can see everything. Yes. As you can see, I am standing on the Atlas Plains. That was chapter 6 that I beat, which means today we are doing chapter 7 of Troll emblem. Marky Joe hasn't seen chapter 6 yet because I haven't uploaded it yet, so let me recap chapter 6 real quick. Remember those three NPCs that you gotta save for in Orion's Bolt? Uh, yeah. Yeah, they were super strong generals with brave weapons and killed almost everything on the map. Oh, cool. <laughs> so we didn't Sounds really... right. Yeah, we didn't really do a whole lot of... Um, yeah, it's the Fog of War map. I didn't really do a whole lot of fighting in that chapter, so the units are not that changed from back when I left in chapter 5. So, instead of uh, instead of joining you, we're gonna give you this Orion's bolt. Have fun. Yeah, I, uh, and I already had an Orion's bolt for Seth. You know that thing that promotes him back into an archer that he already is. So that's that's value right there. That, I'm very glad about that. Oh, did you get any promotion bonuses from that? No, <laughs> of course oh, not. Of darn. course not. I got nothing. So, dude, yeah. there are some Reach Fest submissions that like a character will promote into the same class they just were and just get bonuses and you could just grind them up forever. Yeah, I've seen that, I've seen that, I've seen that. Yeah, no, I don't have any promoted characters yet. Uh, the newest character that I have is uh, Soldier, who looks exactly like whoever you put your cursor last on. So, right now it looks oh. like Mulder, but if I just move like this, for example, it looks like Naomi. So that's, that's okay, so Joshua. It's like, it's like an evil version of them, like yes. Neon Naomi. <laughs> yeah, it's like Negaverse Naomi or Negaverse Kulm. Or like, if you're very fast with your cursor, you can do like, go, for the, go Vanessa, go Soldier. Ah, it didn't work, didn't work, damn it. But either way... Who are you? Yeah, the squad... <laughs> go just, ahead. Yeah, the squad didn't didn't change very much. What, what were we going to say? <laughs> <laughs> I was going to be like, who are you? I'm you, but stronger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm you, but better, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, nothing a whole lot has changed. I gave Arthur a flux, because he uh, he's an eyeball, so he can use dark... dark magic weapons, so that is awesome. an improvement, I guess. And loot, I forgot to mention a pr couple previous times, actually has an S rank in fire, so she can use the L, L fire tome as well. Oh, of course. That's really all the changes I made. So let's get into the Renval chapter, the river chapter. The big one, mm -hmm. where you can like, either you can go around or you can just cross the river with Vanessa and win. <sighs> does anyone yeah, else, a... does anyone oh, else yeah. find it odd that Erica's path over the map is so extremely linear and straight? <laughs> Uh, I don't know, I never really thought about that. I was just like, yep, that's a map. I could barely tell what the fuck is on this map because it's just a jumble of graphics. GBA did not exactly have the most eloquent graphics. <laughs> I mean, they're functional for the most part. Yeah, I mean, once you're on the chapter map, yeah, everything mm. looks nice, but... <laughs> On the world map, it's like yeah, everything's so sepia tone and everything. Especially in FE8. In other games, it's not even yeah. that bad. But in FE8, it's just like a, a big bunch of gold bricks almost. I, I see what you mean, yeah. It's a blob of yellow and yellowish green. Yeah, it's uh, it's perfect. That boss yeah. looks scary, dot dots. Maybe we should send Franz, you know, to scout the enemy. Maybe, maybe solo the map. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nothing here can beat my pony. I might make. Oh, they're they're all gonna talk. They're all gonna say a line. That's so cool. I might make oh. it to the bridge on the right. <laughs> he has one move. It's time for action. Time for the boulder. Oh jeez. I am an unstoppable mercenary. This is not a smoke on me. Jeez, this is so old. Holy shit, this is so old. I wish I could steal that energy ring. Yeah, I. He has he has one speed. He can't steal anything. <laughs> oh. You should bring me. It'll be fun. Almost like I have a purpose. I don't think so. If only. This looks like a great spot for a camping trip. As an eyeball, I concur. It's me, soldier. Use me. I'm good. Uh, but you're a sword master, so you're not. <laughs> he's, uh, he's a mervinal. He's even worse than that. Yeah. <laughs> Holy light, give me strength. <laughs> Fuck no you, Soga. <laughs> <laughs> no one two range means that you can't do jack shit. <laughs> I really, really hate this army. Me too, man. Me too. <laughs> Bro. Alright, oh this this doesn't look too different from vanilla FE. Let's check out what we've got here. It's chapter chapter seven actually. Chapter seven. The Renvol River chapter. Everything looks the same. I don't think it is the same, but I think it looks the same. What do we got? We got a fighter, the battle axe. Ooh. Strong, you know, I've, but, always, I've yeah. always liked the graphics for the battle axe. Yeah. 
strong but difficult to wield. That is its vanilla description, I think. And um, I can see the whole thing. It's not just axe, range, and weight. So that is also something to note. He just looks kind of strong, but I don't think he like, has any special effects. Unless they've been hidden, which is not unlikely in this one. Dude, that doesn't slow him down, like, even a little. It, his, his con is, like, 10. So I think it's only one point of speed loss. Actually, it is 11 cons, so he doesn't get weighed down by any. So it's actually... Oh, shit! I was looking at the aid. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so he doubles Gillian. Wow. <laughs> that guy's probably, like, slightly dangerous if you wait a minute. Yeah, if I just, like, spend five turns pressing enter, he's probably pretty dangerous, yeah. Yeah. Let's check out this uh, this soldier. He's got a uh, normal iron bow and a pure water, so that's pretty vanilla. That uh, can't go wrong at all, I think. And oh, we... damn. You can't. You weren't able to change the ballista to like iron ballista, were you? Uh, I don't think so. Actually, feel... actually, there's no there's no archer here in, in vanilla. There's a mage here, but now there's a there's an archer here and a ballista. Oh. I always found it odd in the vanilla that there's like a ballista here, but no archer to take advantage. It's like it's just made for Naomi to take advantage of. But now he can use it against us. Well, Not yeah, right that's away. good game design. It's like teaching yeah. you the mechanics. Yeah, I mean, you can't reach it right away, but he can shoot me turn two if I don't make it there. That is interesting. Mm. You got soldiers here with a heavy spear. I don't think he had that in vanilla, but that's going to be annoying if I ever make it there with Gillian with his one move and 20 con. So thanks, game. Very cool. Uh, I really want spear. like every boss to have like a heavy spear so that you can't use Gilliam. <laughs> we got the energy ring mage, it's the Fimble Vetter, which I don't know what it does, but I'm going to assume it's effective on Franz because that seems like something I would do. Because uh, Franz is a flying pony, remember, so he would probably die to this. Oh. And I can't steal the energy ring, I think, because he's going to, yeah, he has six speed. And my Colm, I mean, he's not even deployed, but if I were to deploy him, he would have one speed, so he can't steal the energy ring, so thanks, really cool, really nice. I got some mercenaries with wind sword. That's also effective against France. That's super cool. That, I like that a lot. That's that's great. That's... All right. So basically, the theme of this chapter is fuck the France. enemies aren't changed, but their inventory is. Basically, yeah. They, they, so far, it's all fuck France, fuck France. You know, I have a suspicion about the heavy spear too. I have a suspicion about the battle axe as well. Uh, what not... is it all effective against France as yeah, well? Yeah, I think so. I think so. I, th I think that's it. I think that's it. Okay. Yeah. These all. Yeah. I... We're gonna, we're gonna check that like real quick. We're gonna make sure that we know that for sure. Cause I don't think after the play, like, I don't know what I'm even gonna do here. I guess I'll just put Gilliam here. Cause he's like, his position matters the most cause he has one move. <laughs> I guess the tent is like pretty important to put forward as well. Why would you, why would you even deploy Gilliam to begin with? I don't know. He has a lot of defense. He has 17 defense. He can be useful. Yeah, but sometimes. it's like he can't get anywhere, so he I can't know. even use that shit. Hey, hey, you don't have to convince me not to use Armor Knights, man. If I deploy an Armor Knight, you better know it's worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Yeah, he's weak to it. He's very weak to it. <laughs> he just gets o code. Well, if nothing else, he can attack from range, so he can kind of be safe? Yeah, I guess so. Unfortunately, my friends has got, like, no magic so far. Like, just none. I think his base was, like, 5 or 6. But he's, like, Oof. 8 levels later, he still doesn't have any magic. It's so lame. I wish I could look up what his growth was. In fact, I can look up what his growth is, but I haven't done it yet. <sighs> so we'll just put Gilliam here, have him take the hit, have him come to us. We'll just have the uh, the eyeball go up here. Maybe we can like kill the guy when he goes on the ballista or something. Seems like uh, cool. maybe. Uh, do you know these don't count as flying in vanilla, right? They just they just have no terrain penalties or anything. But they don't. I don't think they are weak to arrows ever. They just they just fly over things. I don't remember. I'm pretty sure that it's just that they they just don't they just don't care about terrain and moving over it. But I don't think they like have the same flyer weaknesses. Oh. I think. Not sure though. Oh, we can always like merc that ballista guy if he gets on there with the dummy. That's gonna be fun Holy too. Holy shit. Yeah, she doubles with it. Luke wow. Badass. She has five Luke's speed. Luke's fucking badass. Yeah, Luke, I mean, it's nothing new, but hey, temp loot is pretty badass. Alright, let's go. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna use Gilliam just because you told me not to. Alright, everyone. If the weapons right, you were- guys, get ready for an <laughs> hour-long commentary. <laughs> if the weapons you were handed looked a little bit odd, that's fine. All part of the plan. Use them and use them often. All right. I don't know what else they would use, but sure, let's go with it. All right, and oh. it's effective against them. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it wasn't. That was good. That would have been funny, yeah. But turns out I, I called my own bluff. Okay, we got him. Let's see if let's see if Arthur can bonk this guy. No, it doesn't look like he can. No. I have to chill here what, for a little wait. bit. You hmm. can at least like stand on the ballista if he can survive at least. Yeah, I don't know about that, Chief. I don't know about that. <laughs> Oh wow! Holy I know God. about okay, that. Okay, that guy is like Omega serious business. Yeah, 
You better send like soldier to deal with him. He's like pretty good against the uh, against axes. I wonder, can anyone rescue him? I bet Molder can like rescue drop him too. What if we do like this and then we go here and you take drop him? He's closer. Yeah, that works. Uh, what are you holding? That's fine. That's fine. And he's got probably gonna like ballista someone, but that's okay too. I don't think anyone dies in one hit from a ballista. This is this should be a vanilla ballista. Actually, there's a really funny exploit I, th I can think of that I want to do. Um, uh, explain it when I if I get to it. I'm just gonna kill this guy with uh, with Franz because he needs the XP so hard. Let me just be careful the blister range here. Okay, that's fine. We can go look here. Use fire. Looking good. And then we can probably even lure the next guy with uh, with Vanessa. Maybe use like the stim sword. Get another kill on uh, on Franz maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see what it, what what the future brings. Going for All soldier. Right, let's, see. let's see how this guy does. Oh yeah. wow, that's like nothing. Yeah. Five hits. That's how the uh, heck is this guy able to like double and one round kill your eyeball, but not Solider? Well, Solider has 15 speed or 14 oh, right now. <laughs> I was thinking about like this one game where Soldier was mispronounced or some shit. <laughs> I don't know what came over me. I was just like, oh shit. I kept thinking to myself, like, wouldn't it be funny if his name was Solider instead? But I guess nah, it like. I wasn't that funny. Brain. I wasn't that funny. Oh yeah. shit. I think she for can shame. use killing edges now. Yeah. That would have been bad. Oh shit, it's going for me right, normally. For hurting. <laughs> it's like the only person that doesn't have, you know, a changed weapon, but he still is effective against Franz. Now that's rude. Mm. Okay, so Franz has actually nothing to kill this turn. Sad. Let me see how. Let's see that thimble better too. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's oh, he thought. survives though. Yeah, that's that's actually really good. Let's 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 try that out. Let's try that out. I actually want to see for a moment. Do I have like extra tomes? Because I think I bought some. Oh shit, I didn't buy extra tomes. I should have bought extra tomes. Shit. Well, I have Loot's Fire. That's fine. You can just trade Loot's Fire. Uh, let's get that out of here. That's why we have tents. That's, that's Actually, tents. that that like Siege Tome, is it usable by Franz? No, I think it's S-Rank. Yeah, it's S-Rank. Oh. So, no. yeah. so Loot is the only Sad one I can loose. use it right now. But hey, that's right now. Uh, you have it, right? Yeah, you have the Fire Tome. I'm very good at buying fire tomes, as you guys can see. So trade the fire tome to Erica. All right, Franz. Let's show these guys what we got. Wait, you didn't get it? Yeah, you gave it to Erica. <laughs> uh, whatever. It still works. <laughs> still works. Yeah. I didn't even need it this turn, to be honest. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. She also has a hoplin guard. Yeah, she does. Uh, I got one of oh, those. Oh, right, right, right. That doesn't protect you from like effectiveness. It no. protects you from crits, right? Yeah, it's what I got in the in the Joshua chapter. I don't know if you watched it yet. But it's just like every chapter and every enemy in chapter 5 was Joshua with the Killing Edge. So I, f I thought it was fair to give myself a Hoplon Guard to deal I with it. I remember I remember playing that chapter and being yeah. like, hey, this is a cute concept. Yeah. And then you get crit and it's like, uh... <laughs> I don't actually remember it being difficult. Uh, it, it might have been like a different version or something. Because I found it pretty like RNG almost. I had to like risk a bunch of crit. But I just used Molar with the Hoplon Guard to kill a bunch of guys. That worked out pretty well. I, you know what I probably did? I probably used Loot's, like, Siege Tome to kill everything or something. Uh, that, that works pretty well. But that chapter layout is, like, pretty challenging. Like, there's, like, a Bolting Pegasus that hits on you every turn. That's pretty Oh, annoying. wow. That's uh, that's pretty nasty. Nice drain penalties, uh, Natasha. God damn. Well, we'll just kill I mean, that's one way to nerf cavalry. Yeah. She's, like, she has, like, a five-move horse. It's, like, big troll. Wow. Yay, pure water, though. That's nice. She's five. Yes, yeah, it's five move. She even she even like laments it at the end of the chapter. She's like, "Why did you give him five move? That's so lame." Okay, let's go. Come here, mage. Yes, fly effectiveness my butt. Wow, it doesn't. Double. And siege tome. Yeah. Out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, no. Thankfully, I checked like all the inventories because that's what you gotta do in these kind of hacks. You gotta check every inventory. Right, let's that see would, if Erica that can like. That would have been amazing. Can, uh, you have a normal iron sword now. We can use that to weaken this guy. Wait, wait, hold on a minute. Her eyes are closed whenever yeah. you go to that. Yeah, Hi. they are. They're like, I think in menus they're like closed, but not in their stat screen. It's very weird. It's like when I check here, they're just open. But when I just trade with her, for example, they're closed. It's super weird. I don't know. I guess like, I guess you're always catching her mid blink. And she's like, hold on a yeah. second. <laughs> <laughs> Never a good time for a selfie. There you go. Get magic, please. Just get magic just once, please. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I timed that perfectly. Uh... Holy shit. I mean, at least she got speed. Her speed is pretty bad too. God damn. Okay, you like can you be any words? Okay. Let's uh let's bring him over here. Have him come here. 
The flyer boys go over here. Gillian. Just like think about what your mindset was back in the day. You probably knew that Franz was short one or two points of magic to meet certain thresholds, so you're just like, all right, let's give him a very low growth to get people's hopes up. I know, right? Well, actually, I don't think, yeah, I don't think she, yeah, she doesn't have the defense to survive this, so that's actually a mistake. She's gonna die to the battle axe if she gets hit, so hopefully he doesn't hit her. That was some, uh, some real overcommitment. Yeah, don't hit me. Thank Dodge you. Dodge it! Dodge. Okay. Got him. Oh, it doesn't, still doesn't double. How the hell? Oh, these guys were fast, right? They had like 10 speed. It's insane. Alright. Well, her defensive res are capped now. She's not getting HP anytime soon. Yeah, no, I don't think so. She's the Sijinja, Sijinja unit. She's probably going to... Uh, oh yeah, Shedinja. Um, <laughs> she's probably going to fall off later on in the game because she just isn't going to get any HP and enemies are going to hurt harder. Yeah, I think at some point I put like in poison weapons to kill her and too. <laughs> oh, Super nasty. Look, at, the, look at how much damage they do to the fronts, holy shit. They like they kill like three fronts. Yeah. Insane. Uh, I guess I can kill this guy from like here. I mean, weaken that guy from here, I guess. Fucking... Hey, dude. Okay. Uh, Remember wait, to wait. murder safely. Yeah. I mean, even Erica gets like hit pretty badly by these, but we should be able to feed this to Franz somewhat safely. Dodge it. Yep. Yeah, dodged. That's what we rely on, baby. The dodges. And then we uh, we just murder with Franz here. Please get magic sometime soon. Love it if you did. Do you survive a hit? I have a feeling nope. that you may have even given. Franz, like zero magic growth. <laughs> I wouldn't put. Oh, wait, no, no, you know what? Because you already got magic from a level up, right? Yeah, I think he got at least one magic some at some point. Yeah. Okay, so never mind that. Okay, you go up Maybe here. it's a five percent growth then. <laughs> Maybe. I guess we'll never know. I mean, I, I, I'm. If I remember after this episode, I'm gonna check uh, like if he build their forest growth, see what they're like. Uh, I think yeah, I'm gonna have to do risk another dodge here, but that's okay. That's how we do around here. Let's just dodge, just dodge. Yes, good units. Let's oh go. Oh my god, why would you see? I'm looking at that and I'm just thinking to myself, why the fuck would you hinge on that? No, you fool. <laughs> well, what's the alternative then? <laughs> like everyone else not, in that area got I killed. I would just straight up not use Vanessa. I'd just be like, fuck it, you're out. <laughs> nah, Vanessa is gonna be great. It's gonna be good. Dude, At some point, maybe. if there is anything that Fire Emblem has taught me, it's to be paranoid to the point where I have a collection of tinfoil hats. <laughs> like, especially FE6 on hard mode, because of the ambush reinforcements and you don't know when they're coming out, you gotta be fucking telepathically communicating with the government or some shit to... Isn't everyone to like, telepathically communic communicating with the government in some way or another? I, well, I mean, I can. I don't know about you, but... <laughs> All right, we'll just take the chip damage here, I guess. This is no safe way to do it, and we gotta be paranoid. That's what Marky Joe told me. Okay, I think uh, I think Natasha can take a hit from that um, that archer. Yay! And I think so uh, long as she doesn't take any damage, that would probably be the only scenarios where I'd use her. I would not take the risk of like anything else otherwise. Yeah, well, basically she take, takes damage from stuff, obviously, but 18 defense is a lot. Like, there's a lot of enemies that just can't hurt her. Like this this Merc, for example, is 16, so he just can't hurt her. And then which yeah. most she gets like some defense and HP, I think. Or not. Actually, I think she gets some HP from promoting. Alright, so let's check out this shit. So the whole concept of Seth, as far as I remember, is like he can only use the short bow, because it's E rank and he has E rank bows, and iron bows are D rank, so he can never use anything else. And the only way to have more short bows is to buy them, and they're like super expensive. They're super good, but they're super expensive. So the idea is like you can have this unit with super good growths and bad bases, but you can only use this one weapon that's like limited in use, it's very expensive. But and someone who played this in my hack told me this. If you make him use a ballista, he can gain weapon XP. Or so he, so he told me. Let's see if he can use a ballista. No! No! I ruled it out. Damn it, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I ruled it out. He, like, he showed me that he leveled up Seth's bow rank through the ballista. I was like, alright, I gotta patch it out. We can't have that. We can't have that. I can't. I can't. Fuck. No ballista for me. Damn it. Oh, you know what? I bet I bet you removed the like skill that yeah. allows them to use ballista. Yeah, I probably did. Yeah, I probably gave him like a custom class that cannot use ballistas. Let's go, Natasha. Wow, nice animation. That's that's yeah, really nice, well made. Nice dance moves. Yeah. Ha, you you want to go to prom? <laughs> you thought I was gonna attack, but I fooled you. All right, I'm gonna feed all yeah, the kills her, to Franz her. in this flyer effective chapter. <laughs> all of them. Strategy is to fake you out. Yeah, twenty four seven probably. Uh, wait. Oh, you're not hurt, 
Right. You're hurt. That's right. Okay. Let's just um let's kill this guy with Molder. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so staff, heal. Heal my healer. I heard you like healers, so I put healers in your healer hack so you can heal your healers while you heal. Mm. Okay, let's let's see that foot race between Gilliam and, and Loot. <laughs> I mean at least Loot will be able to contribute. Yeah. Gilliam Gilliam like Oh my god, you would have to walk like 30 fucking tiles just yeah. to get to the boss! Exactly, and he can't even move over terrain, so it's like a line of force in a way, you just can't get through it, he's just stuck. It's like, nope. Wait, wait, so, question, can you rescue drop him? No, because he's 20 Kong. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I thought of everything. Oh wow, sick level up. Mulder is like, this is why I don't even give him kills anymore, he's already too good. He's already too OP. Franz, oh my god, why are you so bad? Why can't you double anything? Okay, let's go soldier. You can do this. See, I, I think the... I mean, this is pot... This, this is like... This is pot, yeah. really. This is really obvious, but... The, the thing with... The problem with these types of hacks is that because some units are just meant to be like a one... A one-off joke, yeah. you only have like three viable units. Yeah, I only have a couple real units that I can like use. Like Joshua's fairly normal, and then the fact that his portrait looks like a... Like a very bad hacking result. And like Molder is like way too good actually. And then Arthur is like eh. And then Franz is like a real unit that just doesn't grow magic apparently. Everyone else is like a joke in some way or shape or form. I guess Erica's kinda normal too. I would even argue that loot is almost a normal unit because she got a siege tub. She like all these turns she's had the opportunity to contribute contribute something oh, yeah. even though she hasn't. Absolutely. Absolutely. By, by the way, like Mulder's like not a normal unit, but the other way around. He's too good. Like this is not what normal what Mulder does in vanilla. This is what like I don't know. This is like Seth level contribution almost. He's like he's a fucking healing Jagan base. Oh, look at how good he is. I don't know why. I think it's, I think the idea with Mulder was like Mulder the Boulder is a funny meme. Hehe. <laughs> so I just make him super strong. Wait, my... what are you talking about? That's a normal Mulder to me. Yeah, I guess so. I mean. Yeah, looks like a normal model to me if it was like level three promoted. <laughs> yeah, and, and doesn't he have like a Hadoken move too? Uh yeah he does. I didn't put it in because you know back then I was like I the only tool I could use was Nightmare and that even that would like be done be done poorly, but yeah. That is <laughs> that, that is a normal thing, yeah. I remember that from that like the Attack with the Bird. What was it called? The Emblem Brigade or something. You know that hack with like the the sassy bird and everyone else is like being super oh, yeah, rude except Project that one guy. Z? Yeah, I, believe I that's think so. Project Z, yeah. Yeah, I think so. How much attack do you guys yeah. have? Sixteen. Okay, so Vanessa can just wreck them, and they don't have yeah they don't they don't have anything. It's fine. We'll just move Vanessa in here, take this guy out, and this guy can just shoot his blister on me. I don't care. We'll just move through here. Uh, Franz is probably a little too scared of blister. I don't know if he dies to blister or not, but we'll just keep him out of range for now. Soldier can go up here. Our tour can go up here. I guess most of these are not very useful from here. I guess Molder is like always important to move. Seth is like whatever. We don't need him. Let's go. All right, free kills for Vanessa. I think she like needs a couple levels for promotion. And when I, if I can promote her with like a hero crest somewhere, I will definitely do that. Yo, dude, <laughs> do you notice like the shoulder pads on on like oh, her yeah. facing left animation? They're sick. Dude, she looks like she just got back from the NFL. <laughs> she does. Okay, don't kill me. Thank you. That's probably why she's got 18 defense. She's yeah. got fucking abs for days. Okay, so we can like bait an archer over for Franz or something and like get that killed somehow, I reckon. We'll go over here. And I guess soldier can help clean these guys out. Well, I don't know what this mage is gonna do. I think I just switched the mage and the archer because I think in vanilla there's an archer here and the mage is over here. I think that's the way I did it. That's kind of cute. Okay, um, Makes it a, a little more difficult, I guess. Yeah, I mean, I like the list at the beginning. If you don't know it's coming, it's gonna be pretty damn annoying. All right, let's go. I love how you didn't even bother to move loot there. Yeah, fuck <laughs> them. Kill you. Like, why would I move them up? Don't die, please. Okay, thank you. All right. And before the ballista doubles. Yeah. <laughs> it's a brave ballista. Yeah, brave ballista, bro. Oh my god, dude! Holy shit! I was playing Vistaria Saga and what? Saga actually. Hit what? No! Oh yeah, I guess what? the boss moves. That's Bro, good. That's... <laughs> Thanks, Alright, bye, Vanessa. I don't care if you seize the gate. I'm not gonna let you boss abuse. <laughs> Dead. Well... <laughs> you said it, Vanessa. You said it. See, this is why I would not have used Vanessa. <laughs>
eventually something <laughs> like, like that's gonna fucking get you. Uh, uh, what? The, what are these weapons? Holy shit! Why do you have a wind sword and a silver bow? What? Because you. Mecca, why? What did you do? <laughs> what did you do? You such a bad spot here now, dude. Bro. Oh, you're gonna get fucked. Bro. Mecca's turn will activate. Hey, we're back. Cool. Oh god. All right. Well, okay. So we're back here. That's good. Yes. Yes. Um, I know myself okay. too well not to do that. Oh, yeah. I was talking about the whole Brave Ballista thing. Okay, so I was playing Vistaria Saga. That's the Kaga Fire Emblem yeah. thing. And Kaga actually had the fucking balls to have a Brave Ballista in his game. Wow. I mean, Kaga did a lot of weird shit. Like, I know there's oh, like a there's like a sniper in some one of his games. That has like a skill that just keeps the battle going no matter what until like either your weapon breaks or someone dies. And, it, and, it, and it's on a sniper, so he just like he just does two damage to like a guy with 40 HP, but he just keeps attacking until you die, basically. It's oh insane. my god, that's nuts! Holy <laughs> shit! It's hilarious. So this guy's like doing two damage, but the battle just never ends, so it doesn't matter. What he... if you have? What if he dealt zero damage? Would that have like a soft block? <laughs> oh god, I, don't, I didn't even think of that. <laughs> That's insane. I bet it's like one of those games. Oh my god, that's a good level up. I'm so happy. Oh, Yay. Oh, you know what? You know what would have happened? It wouldn't have so soft locked because the guy's durability would have run out. Oh, yeah, you're right. It would, it would break at that point. Yeah. Okay. I actually don't know if Front survives this guy. I didn't check, but I'm, I'm sure he does. He so, does. Yeah. So long as you have the flux tome. Oh, no, I meant uh, Nessa. I mean, uh, Franz. Franz is like weak to this, remember? Oh, right, right. right. But he survived the last mage with like one HP to spare, I think. So, um, I'm hoping he can survive. Let's uh, defeat this one to Soldier. So, I don't know how we're luring the boss. I'm gonna have to check his stats a couple extra times. I'm just hoping Franz survives here. Please live. Please. Dead. Fuck! <laughs> Damn pony haters! <laughs> Damn it! I was like, yay, free kill on a ballista with a good level up, yay! And the game was like, nah. Dude, this is what I'm telling you, man. You're not paranoid enough. You should be. Fucking scared as shit, especially since this is younger you. You don't know what younger you was thinking at the time. Sometimes this, is, this isn't even a troll. This was just me being careless. You're right. I was not. I was not paranoid enough. Make a storm. We'll activate. Okay, we were here. I guess we can like we can either rig a miss on this guy. 93 hit. Three your boy. It's not that bad. I want to keep my level up. But like I finally got magic on the guy. I'm not letting that go, no matter what you say. I'm just gonna like not fight the soldier. I guess if that makes a difference. I am not letting that level up go. Miss. No. Fuck. Come on. <laughs> oh boy. I, I, I've been in this spot before. Oh god. In fact, I was in this spot recently in Vistaria Saga. There I there was this point where like Kaka pulled a like surprise on me, and I had no way of like getting out of it because I like saved on the same turn that it happened. Uh it's not, it's not a full and health. I had no Fuck. way to see it coming. Basically, so I had to like constantly reload my save in order to like undo the fuckage that Kaga wrought upon me. Kaga is too strong. I can also rig like, a one percent crit, I guess. There was this one. There's this like there's this chapter where you have this super strong NPC who's like incredibly strong and completely invincible to everything on the map, but Kaga placed this one like optional boss dude near the other side of the map. And your do dude charges towards him, <laughs> and and the optional boss, like on the very last turn. By the way, this is a defense mission. Very last turn. That's the one turn where the optional boss moves, goes up to that guy, and chops off forty points of his health, and Bro. he has forty-two HP. So all it takes is one other dude to hit him with like two damage, Finally. and he's done. And it's Damn. like, what the fuck? <laughs> Why would you do that? I actually thought it was a really cool uh, thing that he did. Uh, and plus, the game gives you a way to avoid that scenario entirely, but I didn't do it because mm -hmm. I didn't know it was there. That guy only had 60 hit. 60 hit, but he kept missing, bro. Or kept hitting. Which had was it accurate? Is with 60. not that unlikely. Yeah, it's Remember, true. this is a 2 RN game. Yeah, 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 but still, still, I like, I, I had like five attempts or something before he like finally gave up and decided to miss. That's the oh, RNG for magic. you, man. Finally got that magic. I got that magic on me. Magic yeah. on me. Magic on me. Magic on me. Magic on me. It is here. 
Is that, yeah, was that take yeah. on me, but magic? Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see your stats again. So you got a silver bow and a wind sword. Doesn't get weighed down. 13 speed is not that much. I can uh, I can bait him with Joshua, or soldier, I guess. Uh, so I can bait him towards me and I can like surround him and kill him, maybe? I, I, I guess if I use like... Let's see how much a short bow does. 27. He has 3 range, so we don't have to get the counter. It's 27. That's like 20 damage is, in one shot. This is probably a perfect scenario for loot to contribute, by the way. Oh yeah, definitely. Loot has the dummy for 20 attack. He only has a 9 res. So we can get him with like the dummy plus Seth plus like a couple of other guys. That's fine. We can we just bait him with the... Uh, with Soldier. That'll be fine. We can, we can you know that. what would be really funny? If like, loot had one move, but she was flying. <laughs> Yeah, I actually think that is like a, a, an interesting way to make armors work better. It's like just remove their train all these altogether, just make them flying robots, like they can go alerts, basically. Yeah, the way I balance knights is to not give them to the player. Yeah. <laughs> 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 all right, he got us. He got us good, nice. but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, so now we just uh, we can short bow him for like a crap ton of damage. It might Oko in fact, because he might crit with twenty percent. Let's go. Boom. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, enjoy your night crests. Uh, if you got it, is it droppable? I'm pretty sure that was droppable, yeah. So I can promote Gilliam with that, I guess. <laughs> Gotta oh, get a wow. two move. I don't even know if I like gave him custom, custom promotion or not. I wouldn't be surprised if he just promoted it into another class with one move. I wouldn't put it past myself. Or like he promotes into a class with zero move. Yeah. At least we got another one of those sexy level ups with Sith. He has like 100% growth and everything. That's That I know for sure. Wait, 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 his HP went up by two, though. I think oh. he has, like... Yeah. So he probably have... has, like, 100 and change. Yeah, I think he has, like, 200, in fact. I think I made, it, I made his growth RNG-proof, because I'm like that. Okay, you just bait this guy with uh, the Josh, and uh, we'll get him with, like, Arthur and, and Franz. I feel like those are the two best targets for kills in general. I think the enemy's still, like, going for Vanessa, even if they do zero damage to her. It's kind of cute, actually. So they can do more damage to Soldier, but they don't care. They're just like, nope. This person's one HP, they're probably killable. Okay, do you die to these in one hit? I'm gonna be paranoid Oh, here. that is a weird exploit in the AI. Yeah. That's why I like Vanessa so much. Okay, so if we just get him down to like five, it should be fine. Stim sword, looks good. I think you can one round him with Franz if you use the Thunder Tome up close. Oh, I see what you're trying to do. You're getting rid of the one durability? Uh, I wasn't really trying to. I just, I, was, I wasn't really paying attention that much. Uh, but we can't one round this guy, so we'll just, uh, we'll just fire this guy, right? Like you said. You're fired! You're fired! Magic, please, again, one more time. No? Okay. Okay. All right. I understand. I've been in this spot where, like, I really want my unit to gain a point in something, so I just keep training them, and then before I know it, they're higher level than everybody else, and they still, still don't suck. have the yeah. stat I wanted. <laughs> they still suck. Still sucky, bro. <laughs> still. I think that's happened with Urk before. Yeah. It can, uh, it can really throw you for a loop sometimes. All right. Last archer. Nice try. Oh boy, let me seize. Hit this guy with my. Actually, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Let's do it. Let's do it. I don't care anymore. I don't care. I don't care. Let's hit it, this guy. Hit this guy. Kill this guy. Did he double? No, of course not. All right, someone capable of doing like no damage. Yep. Great. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. My fault for using a slim sword, I guess. Thanks, the Vanessa. The moment I saw slim sword, I was like, it's gonna crit, isn't it? Yeah. Ha ha ha! Well, they didn't. You didn't call it troll emblem for nothing. Yeah, I mean, I didn't. I expected to get trolled in like hacking ways, not just like RNG also trolling me. <laughs> but I guess I should always expect that, no matter what. All right. All right. Eighteen turns. Still an yeah. LTC so pace. So this is chapter seven, completed in eighteen turns. Okay. See ya. Yeah, see ya. <laughs> You're supposed to like delay it by five years or something. Like, see ya. Oh, dude. Like when when we're done with this cutscene, I want to do my uh, Don Don one five one zero percent growth playthrough parody impression. <laughs> okay, sure, sure. We'll, we'll give we'll give you some show time for that. But first, let's go find Ephraim. Why is he not picking up his cell phone? Oh Hold. my God. Erica, look in the shadows. A traitor. Oh no. Hey, it's a sage. That can't be a traitor. Princess Erica, and is that you, Seth? The traitor. I'm not a traitor. I'm a sage. Sages are good guys. Oh, okay. Let's go together then, since you're a good guy. Okay. 
problem oh, solved. I was expecting Erica to be like, wait a second, you know, to defy her original, like, oh, I'll trust you thing in the original <laughs> game. <laughs> all right, so are you ready let's, for the impression? Let's hear it. Let's hear it. All right, all right. So this is like mid commentary. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Despite his rather lackluster parameters, Roy is surprisingly good in this chapter. Yeah, thanks to the bonus applied to his rapier, Roy's damage output is high enough to one round kill most of the enemy paladins, which is just what we need to clear a path to the throne. To quote an old meme, this is the one chapter in the game where you can feasibly say Roy's our boy. Lastly, in this chapter, we need to employ the Don Don Classic, a rescue chain followed by warping the warp staff to our warp user to warp Mark to the throne in turn one. And that's chapter 29 of our Fire Emblem, the Fried Chicken Lunatic Mode 0% Growths playthrough. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> There were moments there where I, have, where I was having trouble discerning who was Mecha and who was Don Don, but at some point it definitely <laughs> definitely clicked to me who was who. Yeah. <laughs> Funny, we still. I like how you picked the one game that has both Marth and Roy in it, according to the classic question. <laughs> yeah. Fire Emblem 20 coming out 2049. Yeah. You forgot to account for the delay, the inevitable delay, but that's okay. Understandable. All right. We will see you next time for chapter 8 the finale of the early game. See you next Yay. time. Peace-os. Later.